it's your girl Davida Catherine coming back to you with another video if you are new to my channel welcome if you are coming back hey um I hope that you do subscribe to my channel I hope that you like the content that I do bring you so I'm coming to you today with a short video um and we're just gonna jump right into it um I Thanksgiving is coming up Christmas is coming up and you know Making sure that your home looks good is one thing, but also making sure that you have um, nice serving, you know, things um, is, is important as well. Because you want everything, people eat with their eyes and you want everything to look, you know, as, 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 as good as it's going to taste. So I just wanted to show you a few of the things that I did find. One of them I'm so excited about because it's brand new in the Dollar Tree and... Um, a couple of other things I've had already so I'm gonna sh I'll show you what I'm first and foremost excited about and then um, it's and it's not a huge haul I'm actually just gonna be explaining the as literally three things literally okay okay so the first thing is this bowl so this is you normally see these on like um, treat tables and um, at like birthday parties and things like this. You know, I do decorate, I do like balloon garlands and I do help um, one of the partners that I work with with balloon garlands um, and decorating. She does treat tables and treats and things like that. These are always a great find because we can manipulate these and decorate them and change them to the theme. They're plastic, but you can do like a small treat table for like Christmas or for Thanksgiving where you have like little mints and little candies and things like that in them. I think that they, they would make a great addition. And if you wanted to do like a DIY on them and jazz them up, then um, you'll definitely, definitely, definitely be able to get away with it. So I bought four of them like two weeks ago. And then when I went to the Dollar Tree um, last week, I got four more. So, I, only because I can use them, you know, for different events. And they have, like, the little stand on them. I don't know if you can see it. But I just think they're cute. They're really, really cute and affordable for a dollar. You can't beat it. Because the glass ones go for way much more money than this. I mean, come on. Really? And all my DIYers out there know that this would be a great base for, like, a tear tray. Because it has the handle, and then you can put something on top of it. So, speaking of tear tray, I did want to show you this. And I showed you this in my last video. It's like a little dusty. I should have looked at this before. Mm. Um, these are great. They're like a hard tin and whatever. And um, I, I bought, these are a repeat buy for me. I bought these last year. I hosted Thanksgiving at my house last year. And I had little trays like this on the counter that had like the bread and had like, you know, um, I bought, well, I store bought some pies because I am not a big, Jesus. but I store bought some pies and I warmed them up in the oven. And when they came out the oven, I transferred them onto these. They just made it look so much more elegant and so much more put together. So I did end up buying four of them. Now, I was talking about with my DIYers for a nice cake tray that you can jazz up. And say, for instance, like you wanted to use this, right? And then you wanted to use this. You can glue this right on top and create something. I don't know. I'm going to figure it out, and I'm going to come back to you guys with the video because I'm determined. Mm -hmm. Yes, I miss. Okay, and then another thing that I got for my coffee station, and which what I'll do is I'll insert a picture of it. So I have um, a small apartment that my husband and my two daughters live in, and I've always wanted a coffee station, and I'm like, my kitchen is so small, how do I create a coffee station? So at the end of this video, I'm just going to show you my coffee station and how small it is and what counter space that I use to put it together. But while I was in the Dollar Tree, I found... Oh, these are so cute and they they have the ones that have like the hole on top don't mind the mess because you know it does get used and then I like use my Cricut and I put like cinnamon on it because cinnamon is always a part of my coffee station 
no matter what the season is, no matter what this time is, it's always the part. So this one says cinnamon, and then they also have the ones that have like the closed lid on it. Like for instance, if you needed to use like a spoon or something, and this one has um, gingerbread in it. Again, gingerbread is for the holiday season. So after the holiday season is up, then um, I'm most likely just going to uh, wash this out and put it in. And then, you know, I have a couple of blank ones. I brought a couple of extra somewhere up in that cabinet. I couldn't find them, so I brought the ones that I made. Because also, I wanted to show you this. And then this one says season spice. So this one is going to change with every season. And um, this one actually has pumpkin spice in it because it's pumpkin spice seasoning. And then I add it to my coffee grinds and whatever. The whole spiel. I do it and then that's why this one says season spice and again I use my Cricut to like put the letters and stuff on here even though they're crooked now that I'm looking at it mm, whatever and then I also have this one with just the plain white um, sugar which is not going anywhere oh there we go like why my sugar stuff but I have like little spoons at, at the coffee station and um, you know you Whoever comes over to my house and they want a cup of coffee, then they can just take one of my little spoons and they're disposable and then just put them inside the um, their coffee. So these are great. I love it. I love it. I love it. The Dollar Tree has so many things that you can use just to make your holidays and everything special and you don't have to spend a lot of money, especially for my struggling moms out there, first time um, home buyers, which I'm hoping to be next year. Cross your fingers. And um, yeah. So I go, like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that you do like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I am going to insert um, my coffee station um, at the end of this video. I'm sorry. It's late. I'm tired. Um, at the end of this video. And also, what I'll do is maybe I'll do a video on how I'm going to change it for like the Christmas season. I kind of have an idea about what I want to do. So, um, yeah. Thank you, guys. I love you guys. You guys are amazing. And I'm sorry that I'm looking back. I have, like, a mirror here just to make sure there's no lipstick on my teeth. Because, you know, people don't be saying nothing. But they screenshot everything. But, um, yeah. I love you guys. See you later. Bye. Okay, guys. So, here's my little coffee station. I'm going to give you a quick rundown. This Mr. Coffee Pot I got from Walmart and it was on sale for $19.99 and I love it. It has the, the preset. You can set a delay, set your coffee up at night and then have it ready for you in the morning. So I definitely, definitely love that. Here's the little jars that I was telling you about and this mat I also got from the um, Dollar Tree. It's a drying mat and you know sometimes your coffee and stuff spills so I just like to have that under it so it won't ruin the counters. I got these little uh, things from Dollar Tree as well. And I just have like some peppermint teas and the teas I also got from the Dollar Tree, um, apple and cherry. And I also have the cappuccino hazelnut. I do that sometimes. I have the brown sugar in the bowl. And then I also have like the Dollar Tree brand of the um, Splenda. In there and then I don't have any no more of the spoons but I do have some of the forks I get these from Dollar Tree they come in handy when people come over and they want to make coffee then um, they have that or I have I also have like the coffee stirrers here that I also got from Dollar Tree uh, these creamers are from Dollar Tree but I have I also have like the liquid creamers in the refrigerator I got the okay but first coffees from Dollar Tree, which I'm pretty sure some of you have seen, and I did haul it in a video. This I also got from Dollar Tree. I just have some um, toothpicks in here. This one is empty. I'm still trying to figure out. I'm, st I'm still trying to find like the true lemon because I want to have that in my coffee station for my um, for my tea drinkers and then in here I have tea and in here is if I make the cappuccinos then I'll be able to keep it hot it has like a heating thing on the inside and I, I believe I got this from uh, Goodwill so these I created with my Cricut um, the chalkboard I got from from uh, why am I drawing a blank I got from Target. 
target down spot they came four in a pack for a dollar who i don't know why but i did create these little signs with my cricut so that was cool and then i seen like this just showed is the battery dead i think the battery is dead i gotta put new batteries okay this one works so what i did was i went to the 99 cent store um in my mall and these lights came to four dollar so at night instead of having like the, the stove light on or whatever i just press these right here and they stay on and i have them lined all throughout the cabinet so thank you guys for watching my video thank you guys for everything that you do have a great night or day whatever whenever you're watching it bye